Jonathan Lee Riches investigates. Covering the Carly Russell case. Carly Russell was spotted today. And I want to share a clip right here with you of Carly Russell leaving her lawyer's office. So that was right before Carly had to turn herself into the Hoover, Alabama Police Department. Carly Russell charged today with two misdemeanor counts of lying to law enforcement. False reports to law enforcement only faces a maximum of a year in prison per count. And the police chief is outraged. But she was at her lawyer's office. She was allowed to dress up as you saw her before she got that mug shot and she was covering her face right she was covering her face when she knew the cameras were out there and her family was with her her dad i saw her dad and i think her mom was there too but the police chief said they still don't know about those 49 hours when carly vanished right when she did this hoax they still don't know answers Carly has some attorneys in that clip. You could see uh, Lucky Malad, who is working as an attorney for Carly. That was the office, I believe, of Emery Anthony. But if it wasn't his office, Emery Anthony is also defending her two attorneys. And then she gets that special treatment by her family put inside a back of a pickup truck. Coddled. Shielded. People say affluenza, affluenza in this particular case. What do you think? What do you think about, are you outraged or not about the charges of Carly Russell? What's your thoughts? Do you think she should have been charged with more? Seems like the police chief said his hands are tied, but he's going to the Alabama legislature to try to get the laws changed. Will there be accountability? And why doesn't police know what happened during the evening time of July 13th, 2023 into the evening time of July 15th, 2023? What happened? What happened? Subscribe to my channel, like, hit the notification button. I am covering the Carly Russell case extensively and check out my Carly Russell playlist. We will talk soon. Stay tuned.